This is really random, but uh, I did get the wheels on the Durangos fixed. So now there's no more carb rash on any of them. They're just dirty. They haven't been clean in a while. But no more curb wraps. Looks nice and clean now. Wanted to give you guys a quick update on the FISMO 350Z. A couple of changes have uh, happened. As you can see, the wheels are different. Since the last time I posted a video, they were uh, RPF1, flat black, and now I have a set of Hyper Silver Kansai tandems, if I'm saying that properly, for now. And uh, the exhaust has been altered a little bit. As you can see, it does stick out a little bit from the from the rear bumper. That is because I put a three inch extension uh, between the stainless steel Z1 Y pipe and the Tomei catback. So it provides a three inch extension, thus no need for the gold tape that everyone tries to use and doesn't look really well. Just takes away from the the car. And this is the one thing I hate about the wing, is it catches everything right on that front lip. Aside from that, car has stayed pretty clean. Still have no window tint. I'm going to be doing the ceramic 80% all the way around, windshield included. And I am still working on the engine. As you guys know, well, as some of you know, I'm building a 2JZ uh, engine for this. I'm going to be using the same CD trans on it with an adapter plate. Anyways, just wanted to give you guys an update on the Z. I haven't posted it in a while. There you go, guys. If you have any questions about the car, the setup, the Shine Auto, bumpers, anything you guys see in my videos. If you have any questions about it, please let me know. I'll be happy to help you guys out best I can. You guys have a good rest of your day. We'll see you on the next one.